नमो तस् भगवत अर्हत संबुदस् नमो तस् भगवत अर्हत संबुदस् नमो तस् भगवत अर्हत संबुदस् गुड मॉर्निंग माय दाम फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी स्टार्ट न्यू पाली कोर्स दिस so you are welcome this course consists with uh, two books uh, that uh, grammar book and reading book do you all have both books with you have you yeah okay as you all know in theravada buddhism all buddha's teaching are written by using pali language so it is very much uh, benefits for us if you know pali language especially if we want to study buddha's canon pali language very very important uh all right uh let's start today lesson please turn to page number 5 all right in here you can see topic uh, alphabet Uh, in uh, in pali language uh, doesn't have its own uh, characters or letters so we can use our own language characters to write pali as you can see here says uh that pali language consist of 41 letters eight vowels and 33 consonants vowels are a a e e u u a o also a o there's a two type of pronunciation for e and o uh, we will study it later and this uh, 33 consonants divide into six group first group kha kha ga ga um second group cha cha ja ja um nya nya um nya 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 third group ta tha da dha m n n fourth group ta tha da dha n fifth group pa pa ba bha m sixth group ya r l व सा ह ला उम तो साउल अल्फर्ड्स लेट्स गो टू नेक्स्ट पेज राइट राइट इन दिस पेज यू कैन सी प्रोनाउंसिएशन यू कैन सी अ box here you have you have box uh, with four columns okay first column says uh, letters second column pronunciation again third column letters fourth column pronunciation oh, first column here in first column uh, letter a and second column uh, so how to pronounce this letter a it says uh, that uh, a letter a pronounce like y u in but then uh, letter a uh, with dash mark 
in upside uh, it's pronounced like a in art then uh, i i pronounce like i in pin then again i uh, with uh, dash mark in upside this i uh, pronounce like double e in c this u pronounce like u in put u u put and again u with uh, dash mark in upside it's pronounced like double o in soon u soon and again here e e has uh, two type of pronunciation one first uh, e pronounced like a in fate fate a and again uh, e also pronounced like e in ethic a a ethic now uh, then uh, o o also has two type of pronunciation uh, like uh, o in dog dog o o and second one is uh, like o in auto auto it's a river in kanda uh, not a city in kanda and uh, then k uh, k pronounced like k in karate ka ka karate uh, then k h hmm? k h pronounced like k h in khaki 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 then g g pronounced like g in get and this uh, g h hmm? g h pronounced like g h in ghost g g ghost and then n uh, with uh, dot mark in upside it's pronounced like ng in hang hang ng 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 then c c pronounced like uh, c in chance ch chance then ch ch pronounced like ch in chat ch 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 chat uh, then J, uh, J pronounced like J in Ja, and J H, J H pronounced like uh, J in January, January J J, and this uh, uh, N, this N with curve mark in upside, it's pronounced like G N in Signore Signora. This Signor, this Signor, uh, it's uh, what come in uh, Italian language, but in English. Uh, so this uh, N with the uh, curve mark in upside. Ny Ny Ny. Signor Ny. And then uh, T with uh, dot mark in downside. It's pronounced like uh, T in not, not, and then again uh, TH uh, with the dot mark in downside. It's pronounced like T in ta, ta, ta. Uh, then third column D, uh, D with the dot mark in downside. It's more like D in dad. D, d. Uh, then uh, uh, DH again with uh, dot mark in downside. Uh, pronounced like DH, DH in Doty. Doty. DH. Da, da, da. Then uh, again N with uh, dot mark in downside. 
it's more like uh, n in hint hint then t this t pronounced like t h in throw th 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 throw then t h uh, pronounced like t h in thoughtful thoughtful uh, then a d d pronounced like uh, like th in this the the this the and dh pronounce like again uh, like th in those those the 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 then n n pronounce like in in noun n n then uh, p P pronounce like P in parcel or P in punch. P, P. And this uh, PH, hmm? PH pronounce like P in Pakistan. Pa, pa, pa. Uh, this B, B pronounce like B in biscuit or pan. B, B. BH pronounce like p in bhutan bu b b b b and m m pronounce like m in march m and y pronounce like y in yahoo yeah and r r pronounce like are in raft or run r. then uh, l l pronounce like l in large or loud l, l. then v v pronounce like v in was w, w, w. and then uh, s S pronounce like S in sock or sun. S. Then H. H pronounce like H in half or hub. Uh, then L with dot marks in downside. It's pronounced like L in large la la large and uh, m m with the uh, dot mark in downside it's pronounced like uh, ng in ring mm, mm, ring ring all right uh, and here uh, you have a note with the uh, two star mark uh, let's read it uh, <clears throat> the vowels e and o are always long when followed by a double consonant they become short example at the here auto lip o camel all right uh, but, uh, uh, look at this uh, box in this box uh, long E and O red color and uh, blue color and uh, <coughs> echo manso the meaning is one person in here uh, uh, red color E Red color E is uh, long. It's pronounced like A in fate. A. So A co. A. And uh, blue color O. There's a two O's. Uh, blue color O uh, also long. It's uh, pronounced like 
co in dog o so here a co manu so one person long e and o here uh, then a uh, sort e and o green color and purple color here example etta tito utto meaning is the camel that is stayed here okay here uh, the here the uh, green color e is uh, in a before uh, double consonant you can see double consonant here that uh, double t double t uh, so it uh, pronounced like e in ethic e in ethic uh, that's why it's pronounced like et not et it's a et tito and here uh, purple color o also is in uh, before double consonants that's again a double t double t with a dot marks downside uh, so uh, this o pronounced like o in auto so pronounced like auto auto uh, this auto is a capital city of canada uh, that's near situate near to the auto river so, uh, so here the e and o green color e and blue, uh, purple color o are sort Eta tito to here the the this uh, black color o is long so uh, here pronounced like otto all right uh, that's about the uh, pronunciation uh, let's go to the page number seven oh yeah uh, first zero first uh, part of speech part of his speech in uh, Pal language uh, generally there are four groups uh, that are in uh, uh, we can see here these four groups for a sentence uh, sentence uh, nama noun nam noun uh, it's also include pronoun adjectives declinable particles uh, sometimes you may not know now what is the this declinable and indeclinable uh, it's okay uh, uh, we will learn it uh, later declinable in that indeclinable and then akyata uh, akyata mean verb and upasagga uh, upasagga mean prefix and nipata uh, Nipat mean indeclinable particles. It also include uh, conjunctions, prepositions, adverbs, and all other indeclinables. <clears throat> These are the four parts uh, uh, we can uh, see in uh, uh, Pali sentences. <clears throat> uh, let's uh, go to one by one. Uh, First one, the noun. Uh, let's read this. A noun is a word uh, that functions as the name of some specific things or set of things, such as living creatures, objects, places, qualities states of existence or ideas that's called noun uh, then verb let's read a verb is a word or group of words that expresses an accent such as eat drink an event such as happen or a state such as exist uh, that's about verb and third part is the subject let's read it again uh, okay read it a subject is a noun 
noun phrases or pronoun representing the person or thing that performs the action of the verb. Uh, here we have two examples for simple, simplest uh, sentences. Manuso uh, <clears throat> gachati meaning is there's two meaning. A man goes or a man is going. Manuso a man gachati goes or is going. And the second example is manuso. Hasati. A man laugh or a man is laughing. Manasomi man. Uh, here's uh, one uh, special note here uh, with the uh, star marks. Uh, let's read it. In Pali, there is only one verb form for both present simple and present continuous form in English. Uh, so that's why here is manuso gachati in Pali word, Pali sentence as uh, two meaning in English. Manuso goes and uh, manuso, a man, a man goes and a man is going. There's a two meaning for this one sentences. Uh, so this, uh, Again, there is a, here is a verb, kachati. This kachati verb uh, has two meaning in English, goes or is going. This goes is uh, present simple and is going is uh, present continuous. Alright, uh, let's go to the page number 8. Turn page number 8. Alright, alright. Uh, here you have your first exercise, exercise number one, it says make more than 100 sentences using words given below. You have a box with uh, two columns, first column source subjects, a noun, and uh, second column source verbs. Okay, <coughs> hmm. uh, uh, let's read uh, this. Uh, First column with me. Please uh, read a little bit loud, so it will uh, help you to improve your pronunciation. Oh, okay. Let's read. Wanijo, Wanijo, merchant. Choro, Choro, thief. Mito, Mito. Friend Bupalo Bupalo King Kasako Kasako Farmer Kamakaro Kamakaro Worker Gopalo Gopalo Cowhunt Daso, Daso, servant or slave. Putto, Putto, son. Suryo, Suryo, son. Sakuno, Sakuno, bird. Gahapati, Gahapati. Patriage, I mean uh, this household, the uh, main character in uh, family. Amacho, Amacho, minister. Yodo, Yodo, soldier. Anando, Anando, uh, name Anand. Gajo, Gajo, elephant. Uh, those all are, those are, these all are <coughs> nouns we can use as subjects. Then uh, let's read the uh, verbs. 
ये फर्स्ट वर्ब कच्चति कच्चति गोस ओ स्कोइंग निसीदति निसीदति सिट्स ओ इज सिटिंग सायति सायति स्लीप्स ओ इज स्लीपिंग tittati tittati stands or is standing keelati keelati plays or is playing davati davati runs or is running hasati hasati laughs or is laughing agachati agachati comes or is coming rodati rodati cries or is crying nachati nachati dances or is dancing uddeti uddeti flies or is flying udeti udeti dons or is drawing nahayati nahayati bath or is bathing or has a bath or hang about ahindati ahindati walks or is walking uttahati ut uttahati o uttati uttati wakes or is waking miyati 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 dies is dying now by using these two columns we can make simple sentences Uh, as example, let's take this uh, Vanijo, Vanijo merchant. So, Vanijo kachati. That means merchant is going or merchant goes. And Vanijo nisidati. Vanijo nisidati. Merchant sits or merchant is sitting. Again, Vanijo sayati vanijo sayati merchant sleeps or merchant is sleeping another one vanijo vanijo tittati vanijo tittati merchant is standing vanijo kilati vanijo kilati merchant is playing again vanicho davati vanicho davati merchant is running vanicho hasati vanicho hasati merchant is laughing vanicho agachati vanicho agachati merchant is coming again vanijo rodati vanijo rodati merchant is crying vanijo nachati vanijo nachati merchant is dancing I like that way uh, we can can show is choro mitto any of this uh, noun uh, take as subject and then take this any of these verbs and make sentences practice this uh, you more and more practice it is easy to memorize these words it is natural uh, so you can make more than 100 
sentences using this box please do this exercise later all right uh, then let's go to next page that uh, page number no no uh, before go to the next page uh, we have another uh, we have to learn about objects so uh, downside the, the this box we have number four the object uh, let's read it a object is a noun noun phrases or pronoun that refers to a person or thing that is affected by the action of the verb it's called or also called direct object and here number five the word order in a simple sentences let's read it here the Pali word order is not like English in English the object is coming after the verb it's called SVO subject verb object is go the general way of sentences in Pali is that the object is coming before the sub before the verb uh, but this is not a fixed rule so sometime it may change yeah subject plus object plus verb s o v this is the normal uh, sentence order in Pali uh, later you will be familiar with this rule now don't worry uh, okay let's another note with the red with the dots here uh, let's read it uh, there must be a relationships concordance between subjects and verb predicate that the verb predicate must agree with the subject in number number means singular or plural and person first, first person second person third person uh, don't worry <coughs> uh, for now you people just keep this rule in mind uh, uh, later you will understand what it means and it will familiar with you later when you do the exercise now let's see, go to the page number nine then page number nine and here here is another rule let's read an adjective participle two must agree with the noun it qualifies it describes in gender number and case uh, this rule also you can understand later just keep it keep it mind now uh, let's go to the this uh, example we have to example here buddho dhammang deseti the lord buddha is delivering a dhamma talk buddho subject lord buddha subject dhammang object a dumb talk object they say the verb is delivering verb dham buddho dhammang they say the the lord buddha is delivering a dumb talk here second example tero 
ambang bunjati tero ambang bunjati the elder monk is eating a mango tero subject the elder monk ambang object a mango object bunjati bunjati verb is eating is eating tero ambang bunjati the elder monk is eating a mango uh, you can see this uh, see the you can see here word order difference between two language subject object verb pali english subject verb object this is the word order difference uh, in pali you can see verb comes after the object verb comes after the object and in english Verb come verbs comes before the object. Verb comes before the object. And now you have another exercise, exercise two. Uh, here says uh, make more than hundred sentences using word given below. Uh, this box has uh, three columns subjects subject nouns uh, objects nouns and verbs mm. first uh, let's we read once these uh, all nouns in these columns uh, you can read with me please read uh, read a bit loud then you can uh, uh, you can uh, your pronounce ability will increase. We'll uh, develop with the, if you if he if you pronounce with me loudly. Here, uh, subjects first subject Lake Co Lake Co writer Kumaro Kumaro Prince. Asso, asso, horse. Go no, go no, ox or bull. See ho, see ho, lion. Sunako, sunako, dog. Migo, migo, deer. Pandito. Pandito, wise man. Kumbakaro, Kumbakaro, potter. Luddako, Luddako, hunter. Mitto, Mitto, friend. Uh, those are all nouns. So you can we can use as subjects. And then. Uh, Let's go to the second column, objects. Uh, read it with me. Tinang. Tinang. Grass. Mangsang. Mangsang. Meat or flesh. Ajang. Ajang. A goat. Wanerang. Wanerang. A monkey. Rukhang. Rukhang. A tree. Pupang. Pupang. A flower. Palang. Palang. A fruit. Pottakang. Pottakang. A book charting charting a pot o the nang o the nang boiled rice gay hung 
gehang, a house. Uh, those are uh, objects, noun. Uh, let's go to verbs. Mm, first verb is bunjati. Bunjati eats or is eating. Kadati. Kadati eats or is eating. Mareti. Mareti kills or is killing. Paharati. Paharati hits or is hitting or beats or is beating. Chindati, chindati, cuts or is cutting. Banjati, banjati, breaks or is breaking. Likati, likati, writes or is writing. Mapeti, mapeti, makes or is making. Builds or is building, creates or is creating. Harati, harati, carries or is carrying, takes away or is taking away, or steals or is stealing. Aharati, aharati, brings or is bringing, or fetches or is fetching. Last one, yachati, yachati. Begs or is begging or ask or is asking. So, verbs. Alright, now uh, let's be using these uh, three columns. Let's try to make uh, sentences. Here's example. Lake uh, Ko, writer. Mang Sang, meat, flesh. Bunjati eats or is eating. Lekako Mansang Bunjati. Writer is eating meat. Uh, here, this is the subject object verb. Here, here it's given, uh, gives a, <coughs> a Pali sentence order subject object verbs. So, it is easy to make sentence. You have you. Take one by one, one, one by from uh, each uh, column. Then it's uh, naturally, it's easily uh, you can make a sentence uh, like here. Uh, lake ko, uh, then object from second column, mansa, and last verb, punjit. Writer uh, is eating meat. Let's take another one, another example. Asso Tinang Kadati Asso Horse Tinang Grass Kadati Eats or is eating Asso Tinang Kadati Horse is eating grass Asso Tinang Kadati Horse is eating grass Let's take another example. See ho, lion, ajang, a goat, mareti, kills or is killing. See ho, ajang, see ho, ajang, mareti, lion is, lion is killing a goat or lion kills a god. Si ho ajang mareti. Man is killing or kills a god. Uh, you can uh, make also funny sentences too. Like uh, like uh, this one. Uh, Lekako writer. Tinang grass. Kadati. Is eating. Lekako tinang kadati. Writer is eating grass. Uh, it's a, a somewhat funny, uh, like a funny sentence. 
sentences uh, it's okay uh, making funny sentences uh, because uh, you just want to memorize these words so it is it may be it may help it help you to memorize these uh, words uh, making funny sentence like ko tinan kadati right uh, is eating grass like this way uh, now you can um, make more than 100 sentences using these boxes uh, please uh, do this exercise uh, later now uh, uh, let's go to the page number 10 here we have number six uh, topic the the instrumental or the instrumental case uh, uh, let's read this okay let's read the instrumental is a form of noun pronoun or adjective the instrumental refers to a thing that is used to do something or instrumental helps to verb to do its action that means instrumental answers to the questions with whom with what by whom by what by means of what because of what because of whom here note mm. in english the instrumental noun is placed after the object but in pali this is not fixed most probably after the subject uh, uh, let's go to the example then you can understand what it say here uh, you can see manusso lagulene chorang paharati the man is beating a thief with a baton manusso subject the man lagulene instrumental with a baton instrument chorang object a thief object a thief paharati paharati verb it's beating it's beating so manso lagulene chorang paharati the man is beating a thief with a baton see another example Naro Asena Pabbathang Kachati Naro That means uh, The man goes to the mountain with the horse Naro Subject The man Asena instrumental with the horse with the horse instrumental Pabbatang place place to the mountain to the mountain Gachati Gachati verb goes or we can say is going the man is going to the mountain with the house or the man goes to the mountain with the house in this example <clears throat> the man uh, is beating to a thief with the help of a, ba a baton uh, this baton this baton helps to the action to do its beating job so that's why we place the baton in instrumental case in this sentence <clears throat> and also you can see the word order difference 
In Pali, subject, instrumental, object, verb. In English, subject, verb, object, instrumental. Uh, you can see, in Pali, instrumental noun came before, comes before the objects. And in English, the instrumental noun come after the objects. And these example, Naro Asene Abhatangachati. Uh, the man is going to the mountain with horse here for the to climb the mountain for the man it's uh, for this accent for the its accent uh, it's helped this uh, horse to do this uh, accent that climbing accent or to going uh, uh, going accent so that's why in Pali here we put this asa uh, aso uh, it's horse asen uh, in an instrument case uh, that is uh, uh, for the man and for the, uh, the man to the man to do its uh, job the verb is going goes is going to complete this uh, action the horse is helping so if we can ask a question like this way uh, the man is going to mountain with the help of whom with the help of whom answer is with the help of horse uh, uh, you can uh, understand this uh, uh, sentence order more when you do example let's go to the example uh, exercise uh, and before go to the example, uh, I have to say something, uh, another thing, uh, that this uh, this word order in Pali language, uh, this uh, the place of the instrumental instrumental is not a fix, uh, fix there is no fixed place in a Pali language. It may change. It can say this instrument can uh, place after this object also. So we can say manuso chor uh, choram. Lagule na paharati, like that way. Or we can take this lagule uh, na instrument case in front of the uh, sentence, front of the sentence. So lagule na manusso chora paharati. There's no difference in uh, mean, uh, but the general order is uh, in uh, uh, Pali language. Uh, this is the general order: a subject, instrumental, then object, and verb. Mm. Okay, uh, don't worry, don't take it as uh, if you confix, uh, don't confuse. Uh, it's all, all right uh, later when you read, when you do reading exercise, uh, you will familiar with this uh, what I said. Uh, the, just now, just keep in mind this uh, rule subject, instrumental, object, plus verb. Okay, let's go to the uh, next. Exercise. Uh, let's go page number eleven. Yes, page number eleven. All right. In this here, you have another exercise. Uh, uh, this box has uh, four columns. First, uh, subject column, then uh, instrumental column, then uh, object column, then last uh, verb columns. Uh, these uh, subjects nouns are you already know. And objects and verbs already know uh, the instruments is new things uh, so let's read this uh, instrumentals on with me read it loudly okay mm, yeah first one Dante Dante with a teeth Yante na, yante na, with a machine. Mante na, mante na, with a spell. Vise na, vise na, with a poison. Hatte na, hatte na, with a hand. Pade na, pade na. With a leg, 
Parasuna Parasuna with an X Sakatena Sakatena with a card Asina Asina with a sword Mukain Mukain with mouth Lakania Lakania with a pen. Okay, uh, here subject, instrumental, objects, verbs. This is a normal Pali word order. So we can uh, write easily, we can make easily sentences. Uh, let's uh, make sentences now. Okay, let's make sentences. Subject. Lake Co. Lake Co. Writer. Lake Nia. With a pen. Pottakang. Pottakang. A book. Likati. Write. Voice writing. So. Lake Co. Lake Nia. Pottakang. Likati. The writer. Is writing a book with a pen. Lekako, lekania, potakang, likati. Another one. Kumaro, prince. Instrumental. Asina, with a sword. Objects. Ajang, a god. Verbs. Mareti kills or is killing. So Kumaro Asina Ajang Mareti. The prince is kills or is killing a god with a sword. Kumaro Asina. Ajang Mari. The prince kills a god with a sword. The prince is killing a god with a sword. Another example. Asso horse subject. Instrumental. Padena with the leg. Objects. Rukang a tree. Verb Paharati beats is beating. So Asso Padene Rukang Paharati. The horse is beating a tree with a leg. Asso Padene Rukang Paharati. The horse Speeding a tree with a leg. Alright. You can uh, make also funny sentences. Uh, as I said before, it is okay to make funny sentences because you just want to memorize words and the word order. So please do this uh, exercise later. Uh, now, <coughs> almost uh, one hour so it's uh, uh, now it's, let's stop today here uh, so uh, before you come next day please uh, do all the exercises and uh, read this uh, this grammar book and uh, reading books at least once uh, once time mm, right all right uh, may all means be happy and ease.